Konnichiwa. Welcome to another episode of Zoom Zoom Obsessed. We have finally finished our bedroom. That was... I thought that was going to be like a big like... We did it! And you're oh. like... And we well, I was, finished our bedroom. While we were saying it, I was kind of like... like is that how I want to say it? But I, I mean, that's really what it is. We've lived here almost a year. And, um... No, not... not you know, like, ten months. And, uh, we have finally done something with this room. We had a room dedicated to our collection of Tsum Tsums and just anything Disney. And then we decided that we wanted to have the kids have their own separate rooms. And plus, we wanted to put it in an area where it would give more appreci a appreciation... Um, which is, wasn't really getting any, we didn't like go in the room all that often. We only went in there to shoot videos. And so we didn't really get to enjoy it. And that's the point of having a collection is enjoying it. Um, so we moved it. That's the point? Yeah. Okay. So we moved it to our bedroom and, um, we had to do a little DIYs and, mm. um, trying to figure out how to get this to work. So we're going to take you on a tour of our bedroom and what it all looks like. I think it actually came out pretty good, but you'll have to be the judge for yourself. Mm -hmm. This is the back corner of the room. Uh, we have this like bookshelf here, which just kind of has miscellaneous stuff on it um mm -hmm. it has all the vinyls so all the mystery stack packs uh, up top we have sailor moon uh pops and just kind of like anime -y stuff we have like uh yuffie from final fantasy uh seven and uh character from ava with sora and such and then we come down to our mystery stack packs which it looks like they're finally done with um according to everyone that series 12 is gonna be the last series so Considering last series really was all like reshoots of everything else, it makes sense. And then we have most of our micros down below on this shelf. The Princess Castle, the subscription boxes, whatever. Of course, Sven's playing in there. Yeah, he's. <laughs> Do you want me to fix him? Is no, that, it's fine. Uh, well, he's sound an adventure. Yeah, this uh, shelf's kind of a mess. Yeah, uh, yeah. It got messy. Don't mind that. <laughs> and then on the bottom we have just miscellaneous cute stuff. I guess this is a cute shelf. Yeah. Our Anna, some Milo Pony stuff, some to Pops. Yeah. yeah. So here is Mark's favorite part of the room. And the first part that we worked on, which was the Star Wars area. Um, yeah. I don't know. So we originally started with this set here. And then Mark ended up buying way too many, and then we were started to start... Wait, 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 what is way too many, really? And then we were running out of room, and we had put this shelf up here, and we were running out of room, so we had to add another shelf. But then now you can see that there is a lot of room, um, because today we actually decided to kind of repurpose some dresser drawers. Um, we were getting rid of a dresser, and we decided to take them out, kind of flip them over, and make a makeshift bookcase, I guess. Um, it really does look good. At first, when it had nothing on it, it looked kind of cheesy, but I actually like it. Yeah. I mean, eventually we want to do something really nice with this fireplace. We just don't have the money now, and, yeah. you know, reduce, reuse, recycle, whatever. Yeah. And as Christian and, said, it looks better than a black hole in the wall. Right. Is what it was before, so. Yeah. Um, so yeah, so Mark has, does a collection of books, he's got some pop figures, he's got a boatload of black series and, um, Lego advent calendar and just a bunch of Star Wars knickknacks. So in this corner we have our Mega Tsum Tsums, our Larges, and, um, our, like, micro advent calendar down at the bottom. Um, we have the Rescue Rangers bag, which we, I think the plan is to at some point hang that from the ceiling, but we just haven't done the materials yet, so I guess the room really isn't finished. Hmm, um, yeah. And then we have, um, this corner of our pictures. We have all of our, uh, things we got from D23. Uh, we have pin boards. We have our lip smackers and, um, the baseball case. Um, I think there's one missing. Sally, I'm pretty sure, fell. I don't know where she is. Yeah, they're kind of, yeah. They're kind of Well, all over the place. you can see that they're falling forward, and that's because this wall 
uh, Aubrey's room is right on the other side, so anytime anybody bangs against this wall, everything on this wall just kind of starts to fall forward. Yeah. Um, so that's already happened. Yeah. Um, yeah. And so which makes us super nervous about this wall, <laughs> which is we are uh, afraid any moment that this might fall down someday. <laughs> no. Yeah. So I think we showed this in a video before, but we reused this bookcase, which was in the studio and... Um, Not book, uh, shelf. Book shelf, yes. Um, and then we put on the... Yeah, I mean, you get it. You can see what it is. Um, <laughs> and then um, for the shelves, um, it was, these were an interesting find. We originally were just going to get wood and paint the wood and hang up the, the shelves. and um, But we actually found this. I don't even know what it is. It's for um, outdoors. It's yeah. Like, it's, it was pre already white. It was like... So, like I mean, it's all like, it's white on the inside. This is the cut side. So it's just white on the inside. I don't, I don't know what material it is. Um, and then we used, I don't know if we could show, um, where's the bracket? Oh, down here, we just used like these, um, L brackets to hold the shelves up. So, um, this one, we have two L brackets on it. And then the longer ones, we have three, um, so I had measured and when we went we went to Home Depot, had them cut it to size to what length we wanted it to be and then um we hung it up. Um as you can see, keeping them up and not, without falling over the edge. Um That was my biggest concern because Christian was yeah. like she drew out this paper and I'm like, Oh, it looks great, but I just don't really know how everything is gonna not fall out the sides and right. if you look at it right now it almost looks like magic like how is it that those things are not <laughs> falling because this one definitely looks like it should be falling yeah so originally i was gonna put dowels in here and like basically thread it through and so it'll but then it would cut into more space that we have so we would have ran out of space and then um so as we, it is we had literally exactly the amount that we needed right um, so what we ended up doing is, uh, originally we got ribbon here, and we kind of, like, wrapped it around. Yeah, you can actually see underneath, if you, like, look under here, you can yeah. see where it's wrapped under the shelf. So, like, this one, we, I just wrapped it all around the shelf, both the shelves, so then you got this effect. And then the other one was a little tricky. We were able to wrap it here, but then over here, I had to, like, tape it, which is it's still holding, surprisingly. Um, but yeah, that's how we keep it up. And then just kind of like organizing it, um, was interesting. We decided to organize it by movie release. Because that way we'll never, there'll never be another movie released before 1939. Right. So that way this bottom is done. Yeah. So that's that. And then, yeah, we did it by movie release. And then we went into, I think, Parks. And then with the parks, we actually did a little different too. Like, um, we didn't we did do it by land. We did it by land. So, like, there's transportation, and then there's what Main Street. I mean, pirates we kept. But the transportation, even like we yeah. mixed up because, like, the Flying Dumbo, technically it was part of the transportation set, but, but it we goes put them with Fantasy, Fantasy land. land. So, and like Mr. Toad goes in with Fantasy Land, and like yeah. the Astro Orbiter goes in with Tomorrowland. So uh -huh. we, now that they're not really releasing Tsum Tsums anymore, we can be a little more creative with the right. way. Like the Splash Mountain went with the Splash Mountain mm -hmm. set, because why right. not? And then on top of that, we did all holiday, kind of. We had to get a little more creative, too, because we were kind of like at weird spots. But, yeah. um, but it was like kind of holiday type. And then up top, we did box sets, and then... Uh, well, yeah, box sets, and then all Star Wars. So we kind of, like, use the box sets as bookends, which yeah. I'm stunned that those haven't fallen out yeah. yet, actually, but... Yeah, because there's nothing holding those yeah, in we place. Yeah, there's <laughs> obviously no ribbon, because you can't wrap it around the top, but yeah. they're all still there. And so. then we got, like, Mickey and Friends, and Mark wanted to get rid of, I think it was mostly all those ones, or all <laughs> those ones, I don't know. I don't but know. he wanted to get rid of a bunch of them, and I'm like, no, because <sighs> now, look, it's perfect. It's, like, it the perfect... Good height and they match because i yeah the mickey and friends are like my favorite ones and they're my least favorite and it's his least favorite and yeah and those are all of our box sets and um this is what we have left of our Tsum Tsum collection but it doesn't look like that it's actually a lot of Tsum Tsums. like that's hundreds of Tsum Tsums, but it doesn't yeah. really look like it when it's just on the wall like yeah that. i mean and compared to like what we had before it's a lot less i don't know it's not that much less it feels like a lot less. it feels like less but yeah. uh, it's not really that much less but yeah. I mean, we, yeah, we went with keeping the ones we love. Um, yeah. So, yeah. So, that's our collection. I think it's pretty well, I mean, as far as Tsum Tsums are concerned, 
Yeah, that's pr probably it. I mean, I, I don't think they're going to be releasing any more, um, mm -hmm. or certainly not in any sort of volume, and it looks like just in Japan at this point, so. Yeah. And if not, I mean, if they do release too soon, it's gonna, it seems like it's only going to be, like, very once in a while, and maybe only just in the parks. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, they, well, we did just get Wreck-It Ralph. Yeah. But that was, like, in November. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, Who knows? I feel like it's every couple of months. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, they've been a new set with every released movie, right? There was Incredibles 2, mm -hmm. and then there was Wreck-It Ralph. So, I don't know. What's the next movie? I mean, Toy Story they could 4. have done Mary Poppins. They never really did anything for the live-action movies. Toy Story 4 comes out in a couple months, and then that's when we'll really see. We'll right. be a set for that. But, I don't know. Who knows? If you guys are regular viewers of our channel, you've known that we've, um, it's been a pretty rough year for us on YouTube. Um, it's been up and down and... Really, cat. <laughs> it's been up and down and we've, um, started doing videos and then stopped doing videos and then started again and then... I feel like at this point it's, our channel's on life support and it's just time to... Cut the cord. Yeah. Turn off the machine. Yeah. That's it. I mean, I, it's not reviving. It's just, I think... Uh, We're flatlined at this point. There's a lot of reasons why, but I think, you know, the last... I mean, it was a Tsum Tsum channel. That's what it was. Right. And like, that's what we were passionate about. And there are, and when Tsum Tsums come out, I still get excited to shoot videos about them. But I just don't really... I don't know. For whatever reason, they're done. And we've lost our passion for doing it. So, yeah. you yeah. know... So I, and it was a trend, and that's what happens with trends. It's a short-lived, that's why it's called a trend. It's just short-lived thing, and then now there's a new trend. And, um, you really chippy? She's going to be a short-lived cat. <sighs> um, so, I mean, and we tried doing the whole, like, moving on to Disney things, but nobody really was interested in that type of content. And we weren't really that interested. And, like, we didn't really have the yeah. passion or the drive. Like, we had the Tsum Tsum idea and it was really fun and we had a lot of fun with so many amazing people that we met and so many amazing videos that we were able to shoot and and it's just time. It's, it's time. The end. It's time to say goodbye. So does that mean, is that the end of the little blanks is the question on YouTube? No! <laughs> <laughs> if you don't know, um, I, I had started my own channel a couple of years ago and I did the whole Kamari method. It's more of like a lifestyle channel. And um, I gave up on that because I just had too much going on. And so this year, 2019, we are going to uh, revive that channel and do more of a lifestyle channel on that channel. How many times can I say channel? Um, but yeah. I think that... It'll be better for us to try to do stuff like that because, first of all, Christian's very passionate about, um, you know, things like zero waste and trying new things in lifestyle, you know, trying to uh, spend less money and pay off debt and, you know, yeah. DIY stuff. So, I mean, that's something mm -hmm. you're very passionate about, so it's something you'll be excited to do videos about. Um, and I think that there's going to be less pressure. I think a big part of the Tsum Tsum channel for us was there was a lot of pressure to this set came out, you gotta go to the store, you gotta buy it, you gotta get home, shoot that video, get that video up. Like, if you're not feeling it, if you're in like, you know what, I'm just not feeling a video tonight. I'm not in a great mood. You know, the kids are driving us crazy. We're just not happy. Still gotta fake it and put a video out when you really don't want to. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, this gives us more flexibility to put out video when we want to and, you know. And kind of have control of what content we put out too. Yeah, we were dictated by Disney's releases yeah. as to what we were putting out. So. And it's like we had to buy sets even though we didn't really like the sets. And Yeah. And nobody, know. not like we had to. Like nobody was, know, nobody had a gun to our head. But, you know, to but do the, the channel point, the way we wanted to right. do it. The point of our the Tsum Tsum channel was that we had a passion for Tsum Tsums and we wanted to show people that didn't really have the opportunity to get Tsum Tsums or... Um, we're on the fence about getting Tsum Tsums, the, right. the first look at the Tsum Tsums. I don't yeah. know. Yeah, so they, yeah. So, yeah, they could see it if they didn't, if they either couldn't buy it or weren't sure. That was what our channel, that was what the point was right. for us right. anyway, was for us to do that. So we just, like, a huge thank you to everybody that has been around. And, you know, if, if you still want to stick around and you want to check out 
our new channel that's going to be just for our family and our life um you can do that we'll, we'll link it how we'll link that? it down below down in below. the description box it is hello christian featuring me Fe with mark <laughs> yeah well, how does that work <laughs> so thank you everybody for watching and yeah thank you everybody for watching for the last how many years has it been two years three years has it been three i think it's been three years i don't think it's been that long maybe it's been that long I think it's been 30 years. Yeah. 2016, 2017, and 2018. Mm. Yeah. Wow. Three years. So hopefully we'll see you over on the other channel. We'll have uh, content pretty much right away. We already have a lot of ideas. Christian's already had a calendar of videos that she yep. wants to do. So starting with a tease, we're going to try going without Facebook for one month. Yeah, it would be interesting. Pretty Easier interesting. for some people than others. Yeah. Come in. Okay, you want to say bye? Yeah. Come and say bye. Bye. <laughs> Jacob, come and say bye. 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 bye.